Welcome back. So we've looked at potential leaks in the gas train to atmosphere, but it's also critical that our gas train doesn't leak into the boiler. And, and what that means is that we need to verify that our safety shutoff valves hold correctly. And one method that we can use to do that is to use a, a pressure sensor downstream of our safety shutoff valve. So in this case, I've just got one valve and that makes it a lot easier. If you've got multiple valves, um, you may wanna have a, a service technician look at this for you. But basically, if I close a manual valve on the outlet of my safety shutoff valve, if my safety shutoff valve holds, we should see no increase in pressure on my sensor. So if we look at our live reading, we've got basically zero pressure on that space between the two valves right now. And that's going to ensure and verify that we're not bleeding through.